Organon, oh, 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 canon, oh, 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 organon, destination, Armageddon, oh, sorry, <laughs> this reader is about Deconia, the complete journey, it's an adventure game in the same vein as uh, uh, Monkey Island, and uh, it takes a lot of inspiration from it. And it shows. You start off as this character Rufus, who lives in a giant yard of sorts, with <laughs> a lot of his friends. And to tell you, to be totally honest, nobody can stand him. <laughs> yes, <laughs> everybody hates him, and uh, it's sort of like uh, you know an emo kid situation. It's not really nice. And then you get to travel on a long journey with him, and <laughs> you should want you know that that he develops over time and uh, becomes a different person. But to tell the truth, I mean, does that ha really happen? No, it doesn't. The puzzles are great. Uh, for the most part, there are some puzzles that <laughs> don't really work, <laughs> and you don't really know what you're going to do or what you're going to do next. And uh, sometimes I had to go into the walkthrough to find out, you know, if there was anything I had done wrong. Or, I mean, in most adventure games, you sit there like an idiot. If you don't uh, understand <laughs> what you're going to do next, then it's really, really not a great feeling. Overall, I say the music and the soundtrack is probably the best. Probably the best thing about it, almost. Uh, in the sequence between the loading times, you get a guy uh, <laughs> sitting uh, playing songs on the guitar like uh, around the campfire and he, he, it's really funny the whole game all around is really funny and uh, yeah overall just uh, good music I'm gonna get you a sample now of my my own talents so here's here's Gold Ruffin Organon oh oh Organon oh 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 Organon Destination Armageddon Sorry guys, I can't let that carry away there. You know how it is. A lot of free time. No job. You know. You have to have a fun in life too. And I think I have a pretty good singing voice. I can't really. And I mean, you can read it from one to ten. I'm gonna. S I think I'm gonna sing in every video. We'll, we'll see uh, if I can hire an orchestra and back me up uh, at a later date. We we get to see about that. So oh sorry, back to the review. Yeah. Uh, so uh, the story really develops uh, over time and uh, you get more and more invested in the characters to tell the truth uh, a lot of people can't really stand <laughs> Rufus and uh, his antics but if you're a Monkey Island veteran and uh, goes off on that kind of humor uh, not really sexually but you know what I mean yeah it's really really nice and really fun and uh, he's got a great vocabulary uh, not yeah and uh, uh, you meet this girl named Goal uh, she's uh, <laughs> she's got a uh, sort of uh, later in the game she's got a split personality she's got like three uh, different personalities that you have to switch between uh, don't ask me how how she got there but you know and yeah, she's uh, a good character, and uh, a lot of characters you meet are uh, pretty 
like there is a humorous theme about all of them but uh, some are more serious than others and yeah, yeah it's great and uh, when you um, get to the third part uh, there are some controversial things <laughs> about uh, the story uh, I'm not going to go into detail but they uh, they uh, the areas they cover are uh, pedophilia and uh, some other things and you know I'm German so I have to laugh when a German guy with uh, a little bit too uh, little hair and too much free time as me opens the door and try to lure children into his van I mean it's fucking crazy but uh, yeah uh, it's my kind of humor and you can say anything like you, you don't have to like it uh, it's just my opinion and yeah that's how it is so uh, to get this game a uh, full uh, a review score well, it was pretty hard uh, I had to think a lot but uh, I ac yeah so I want to do the review score. I give this game an 8 out of 10. And after a long consideration that w seemed uh, pretty fair, you know, I am uh, pretty critical in uh, in general about games. So the reviews you're going to get from this channel are uh, they're not going to be lenient on the games. That uh, I think is very important. I think that uh, that is something that is missing in a lot of uh, reviews that you get. Uh, yeah, it is a good adventure game. It is. Uh, uh, it's not a masterpiece that someone wants to say it is, you know. Uh, but uh, it is a really good game. I would say the second part is the weakest. But uh, I mean, if you play a lot of games, the, uh, there are three or four parts. The middle parts are usually uh, or the the filler parts you know that uh, one has to get to get to the the ending that they had thought out and the story is uh, culmination you know that's just how it is now I r really recommend this game and uh, play it if you like Monkey Island or uh, that kind of humorous adventure game if you want a serious adventure game like Siberia or games of that nature then this is maybe not for you yeah thank you and uh, that's the review of Deponia uh, what the hell is it called? Deponia collection yeah probably that's what it called I'm not really sure uh, like if you liked this video press like and if you dislike this video uh, don't press dislike but yeah, do it anyways if you really want. You know what I mean. Thank you, thank you, and I see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.